yeah that saved my life movie is exactly what i was talking about in my toxic video that i made a few weeks ago so if you haven't watched that movie yet please go and watch it and then re-watch um my toxic video and everything will click <laughs> Welcome back to my channel my name is Nicole if you are new here welcome and if you like my content please subscribe and if you are a returning resident welcome back and don't forget to like comment share and subscribe guys okay so today guys it's a no makeup uh, natural hair kind of look day but in today's video guys I'm going to be doing my nails it's gonna be my first time or my first attempt at doing it so i guess we're gonna be learning how to do this together okay you're gonna be learning with me as i go along um the nail machine that i bought i haven't used it yet. i still haven't used it yet guys uh but today i'm gonna try some press on before we get started though guys i have two movie recommendations for you Two movies that you need to watch guys coming to America too and um, that saved my life you need to watch that movie the uh, that saved my life movie is exactly what I was talking about in my toxic video that I made a few weeks ago so if you haven't watched that movie yet please go and watch it and then re-watch um, my toxic video and everything real quick so this is how i store my nail goodies guys um this is just an old shoe box that i have and i choose to store all my nail items in here everything that i would use to get do my nails okay if you want to get custom person nails guys check out nail bay la and uh, you can also find them on Instagram. I'll tag their information below. They're really good, guys. Uh, from my experience, they also have really good customer service too. So check them out. If you watch my nails machine unboxing video, you'll see where I got these nail arts from too, guys. Okay? So right here, I'm just showing you some different options that are available in press-on nails, guys. You can pretty much get any style uh, that you would get in a nail salon these days in the press-on version. I'm going to be using these two um, nails today, guys. All the nails that are displayed here, I got from AliExpress, guys so you can also get nails on aliexpress for affordable pricing okay this is everything you're gonna need guys um need the nail glue nail file buffer a nail cutter nail clips uh cuticle pushers i have the iron one and the wooden one i uh, I prefer them I prefer this one to use to push back my nails and then this one to use to scrape the the cuticle off like this part because it's a little bit more gentle and you're also going to need um, cuticle oil for when you're finished doing your nails and right here guys you can see that I had already picked out my nails that I'm going to use uh, because I ended up having to do a mixture guys because my nails are really small as you can see they're really small so even the smallest ones that came in this pack were too big to fit on my small nails so I had to pick out some from this days this pack to put on my small nails so i'm gonna be have rocking pink and red nails guys so that's something new um 
and I'm also going to try to put on some designs on the nails as well it's, and right here I have some nail hardener this is optional uh, and then I have the top coat that you will put on after you're finished doing your nails this is the last step okay guys all right so I'll see you back in a few when I'm ready to get started so I'm gonna get started now guys uh, first I'm going to start off by buffing my nails and you want to put a little uh, piece of paper towel underneath your hand to help catch the fall out or the dust uh, just to help with the cleanup process okay and when you're doing this guys please be gentle try not to rub on your nails too much uh, don't rub them down too far okay to where they're thin um, don't do that you just want to rub it enough uh, basically to just rub off the shine off the top of it so basically you're just trying to get it a little bit rough the, the surface a little bit rough so the the nail glue will be a will be better able to stick to your nails guys so when you're done with your the first hand you're just going to do the same thing on your other hand as well but i'm also going to speed up this video guys so this video don't end up being an hour long but you get the drift okay After you're done buffing your nails, you want to file the edges of your nails just to smooth them a bit, okay? Then you want to use the cuticle pusher to push back your cuticles and remove excess buildup. Then you're going to do a little bit more buffing just to smooth down the nails a little bit more. And then you're going to use that little brush to brush off the excess dust off your fingers, okay? So when you're done with the buffing and the filing, you can choose to get a fresh paper towel or just dust off the one you have here and continue. So your nails are now prepped and ready for application. Now you're going to get your nail glue and you're going to use a scissors to clip the tip of the applicator off. Then you're going to use a pin or a needle to pierce a small hole in the top.
And now we're going to apply the press on guys. You want to put enough glue on this for it to hold. Not too much where it's oozing out at the sides when you press down. But enough to um to have a firm grip for it to have a firm grip guys so when you put this on you want to press and hold firmly for a few seconds in order for the nail to stay on there guys okay so one down nine more to go so just continue the same process guys until you have all your fingers covered also guys when you're putting on the press-ons push them up and into the cuticle area as far as possible without um hurting yourself um this will ensure that the press-ons last a little bit longer and it will also help to not let them lift as so easily as well So right here guys, I'm on my final application. And this is what my nails are looking like right now. I really like how they look so far. So now I'm going to use a file to file the edges of the nails just to help make them a little bit more smoother because they do have some little um uh, nubs at the end of them so this will help to smooth those out stay like this guys or if you want to put on some pattern under I said I was gonna try to do some pattern let me see if I can actually do it I've never tried that let's see this and these two let me put some some of this on here nail hardener After you're done applying the design on top of the nail guys, you want to add some top coat over the nail just to help seal in everything. 
and then you're gonna do the same for the rest of your nails So this is me attempting to do my left hand. It was a little bit more challenging than the than to do my right hand. But guys, you want to finish completely finish one hand and dry it first before you start um applying the top coat or even the uh the design to the other hand. Uh just to save yourself from smudging your nails, guys. Because that's what I actually did, guys. I fi completely finished one hand first before I moved on to the other. Uh, you're just not seeing it here because I kind of... Just for editing purposes, but that's what actually happened. When you're done applying the top coat, guys, you're going to use the nail dryer lamp to dry your nails. Uh, for about 60 seconds if you want to find out more information about this lamp guys watch watch my nail machine unboxing video for more information okay guys this is the finished look i'm loving it and i'm so proud of myself these are just press on but oh i forgot i didn't put on this is optional So, thank you guys so much for watching. I really enjoyed making this video. It was very relaxing. So, if you guys like it, like this video, please leave a thumbs up. Leave a comment. Share. And don't forget to subscribe. Until next time. Bye. Some might say that I am just a bad girl. But if you treat me right. Girl in this whole world No, I'm not gonna fight I got my hands on your body So tell me, tell me what you want me to do I can be good or be naughty